Zombie, do you know what I was just thinking? Because I don't. What's up everyone? This is me, Sean, and today I am here on the Mattis SMP server with some more Minecraft. Now, uh, today I'm going to be explaining a couple things to you guys, and also, I, uh, I will be doing just some work on my base, and maybe some on the shop at the end if we have time, uh, but yeah, so uh, basically what I have done down here... Um, which uh, we are in the arena, by the way. Uh, what I have done down here is uh, I have totally revamped the armor rooms. Um, so yeah, now the blue, the blue side looks like this, and then we have the beacon uh, that looks purple, which I really like that. I didn't, I did not know you could do that, like stack um, red and blue and then have it be purple up there. That I thought that was cool. So. Uh, but, yeah, I thought that was cool, and, um, yeah, I'm gonna keep it there for now. Now, if we come over here to the red side, it's pretty much a mirrored, uh, thing of the blue side, but with red. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Did I just say yeah, yeah? I think I did. Whatever. Um, uh, but, yeah, I still have to add in all the armor sets and, uh, all the armor stands and the beds and the storage and whatnot, but... Uh, this is a good start to the revamped armory rooms, and yeah, I just wanted to, uh, you know, quickly uh, show this off real quick, and I guess that's it. So you guys are probably wondering, hey, why weren't there really any videos last week? Um, so, basically, the reason that is, is uh, because I've been having some technical difficulties with a couple series, and yeah, and Starbound is kind of just I don't know I'm getting footage of Starbound it's just I can't really see a way I can turn it into a uh, a good video like I don't know I did a bunch of stuff and made a bunch of progress but it's not really that entertaining so I'm gonna do my best to edit that and uh, release it in a entertaining uh, video but I'm not sure how it's gonna go so yeah uh, also with stuff like uh, Subnautica, I know I did upload a Subnautica video on Monday, uh, but I had to end the uh, video because my recording software started pooping out on me, uh, in like in the middle of recording it, um, and that's pretty much what's been happening with it ever since. I haven't really made a ton of progress, but I've tried to do it, like tried to record, you know, my intros and whatnot a couple times. And, uh, yeah, it's just not going very well. Um, basically what happens is, uh, I keep going from 30 to... Hold up, I need to check my connection. Jeez, alright, I keep going from 30 frames per second on, uh, Subnautica to, like, 7 frames a second. And I think at one point I did get, like, 3 frames per second or something like that, um, in it. So, I'm gonna be trying to fix that. And hopefully, hopefully I can fix that. So yeah, now what you're seeing, by the way, um, with all the... <laughs> dang it, with all this lag. Oh no, this is the reason why I haven't recorded a Mattis video in a while. is because of this. Look at this. I can't do anything. Oh my gosh, I'm not sure. Um, hopefully it'll, it'll uh, go away soon enough. Uh, but yeah, I think it's down to a, uh, it's in a place now where I can actually get stuff done, but yeah, it's just kind of been really bad lately. I don't know why. Um, I'm going to just stick around on the server for a little bit and see if, uh, like, like keep myself logged in and see if, uh, if it gets any better. Uh, but yeah. All right. So, uh, basically what I want to work on today in my base is is uh, I want to go ahead and work on the central spire. Now, I'm not sure if I have actually explained this in the video, but um, yeah, I'm going to do my best to explain it right now. And uh, let me see if I can use visual aid. Do I have any blocks? There. Okay, now it's even. So, so this represents this spire right here. 
Now, the way I want this to work is I want to add one, two, three spires just like this um, all around the base. And I would, and if I did that, I would need a way to link them all together. And that's where the central spire would come in. And uh, it would basically connect all of these uh, other areas of my base. Um, along with, uh, you know, housing, a uh, bunch of different rooms. And uh, it's going to be the biggest one of them all. Kind of thing, you know. I think it's just best if I start the idea and I can explain it, like, along the way. Um, but yeah, that's that's the idea if, you, uh, if it made sense to you. Then, uh, yeah, that's the basic idea of it. So, yeah, uh, what I'm going to do right now, though, is I'm going to dig over, uh, let's see, how many blocks is this? Is it 24? Let's see, I'll go 36. 36 blocks this way, and then we can start uh, with the excavation. All right, so basically the excavation would start right about here. Um, this is going to be one of the sides, so let's go ahead. Let's mark it off with some with some granite. All right, let's just put some granite down, and um, I need to go grab some torches. I'll be back in a second. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna say 14 blocks. We're going to go 14 blocks uh, over with this. So yeah, let's go ahead. Let's count that out. <laughs> All right, so now let's see if we take the diorite and we put the diorite down right here and then there. So if I can get this torch back, all right. This is going to be the middle of the big spire. And uh, yeah, it's going to be quite a bit bigger. And uh, that's the 14 block radius, not a diameter. Whoops. Okay. Um, it's not going to be 14 blocks in diameter because that's too small. Uh, but... Yeah, I guess it's going to be about 28 blocks in diameter, so yeah. That's all good with me, but um, the thing is with this one, I'm probably not going to dig all the way up to the surface, uh, just because that's a long way up. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and um, right now I'm going to cut. I'm going to go get a different pickaxe um, than this one, and I'm going to start hollowing out the giant circle. So yeah, hold on. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use. Cause you can't stop it from shining through. It's true, baby, let the light shine through. If you believe it's true, baby, won't you let the light shine through for you? Alright guys, so this is going to give you a general idea of the size of this build now um, Or of this dig or both, uh, but yeah, uh, so hopefully this gives you some perspective on how big um, I want this place to be so yeah, um, I think I'm going to clear this like all this out above me up to um, I'm going to say 60 because I know that's almost to the surface, but not quite to the surface. Um, so yeah, I'm probably going to going to only clear it up to uh, about 60 or so, 
And uh, yeah, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to do that uh, off camera. And yeah, so the last thing I have um, on my agenda today is, uh, let's see, uh, I wanted to see if we can stock the shop and whatnot. And yes, I am organizing my episodes in here. And uh, yeah, it just helps me to stay on track. Uh, but yeah, so I'm g I am going to go uh, stock the shop. And yeah, I don't know how much of that I'm going to put into the video because my shop is a shop for enchanted books. So yeah, I'm basically probably just going to go stand at the pig farm um, for like an hour or so and just shoot the pigs and get a bunch of XP and enchant some books. So I will record a little bit of that, uh, but not too much. Um, as for the rest of the spire, or at least digging out the rest of the spire, I'll probably uh, leave that for off camera work because you know, this little part of it down here took me maybe 20-30 minutes to do. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to clear the rest out off camera. Um, so yeah, but for right now I'm going to go ahead I'm going to head over to the pig farm. And uh, I'm going to show you guys the pig farm because I don't think I have. And uh, yeah, I'm going to get some enchanting and then we'll end the episode off. Yeah. Alright, so if I haven't showed you this yet, um, which I'm pretty sure I have. I've uh, shown this in one of my videos before, at least one. Uh, that's just a super cool way of getting up to here, and uh, that up there is the pig farm. So let's see if the buttons work, and uh, hopefully they do. Nope, okay, so what's my connection at? My connection shouldn't be too bad. Uh, but yeah, I'm just going to take a minecart out, and we are going to head up to the very top. Oh boy. Um, great. Great, uh, not reception. How about say, it, it, yeah, I'm getting great reception here, guys. I uh, know I'm getting, I'm getting a great, uh, great amount of lag. So yeah. <laughs> um. Oh, this might be left over from last time I was here, but yeah, this this is the pig farm, and uh, it's actually very simple in uh, the way you use it. And yeah, basically what I do is I just stand here, and uh, you just take your arrows, you shoot the pigmen, and they go. And they drop down these uh, these little drop things. And uh, yeah, I think the XP is just pushed into there. And then it's bounced up on uh, on slime blocks like all the way up. And uh, yeah, I actually thought that was really cool. And uh, yeah. Um, also, if you haven't checked out Mattis's, um, Mattis's channel yet, he's the one who made this. So uh, you guys should definitely go and uh, check that video out. I will put the link for the video in the description. And, uh, yeah, channel links are always in the description anyway, so you guys can go check out his channel and that video in the description below. Uh, but yeah, I'm just going to AFK here for maybe an hour or two, get a ton of XP, and then go enchant some books. So yeah, I will be back in a minute. Alright, guys, well, now we're sadly winding the episode down, but yeah, uh, basically all I'm going to do for the rest of this video is enchant some books and hopefully I guess some good stuff um, I'm obviously not gonna keep a ton of that uh, in here but um, yeah I'm going to keep the most important enchantments in and yeah so I'll see you guys when I'm done I guess but uh, yeah I'm gonna end this video off here guys um, so hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did likes favorites and whatnot are appreciated also make sure to put in the comment section below um, what I should do with this the uh, design of this shop uh, because I definitely have a ways to go with the design um, but yeah I'm, I'm kind of a little bit out of ideas for it so your ideas would be much appreciated in the comment section below and uh, zombie do you know what I was just thinking cuz I don't thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video